Holyoke Community College celebrating the traditional Mexican Day of the Dead holiday today. 22 News reporter Melissa Torres is live in the studio after finding out how this Hispanic serving institution is recognizing this celebration of culture and life. Well, Nick, Latinx people love sharing their culture with one another, so HCC's El Centro program and the Latinx Empowerment Association invited the whole campus community to construct an ofrenda. We built an ofrenda, and it is a celebration of people that have passed, a celebration of their lives. HCC held their second annual Dia de los Muertos celebration with an ofrenda. Although HCC doesn't have a large percentage of students that hail from Mexico, they wanted to create a space for all Latinos to celebrate their dearly departed. This is very important for HCC, like having celebrations like this, not only Day of the Dead, uh, but also celebrations that uphold like Latino cultures across the board. I think that creating spaces for folks uh, and having placemaking events like this allows students to feel welcome and belong and that they belong here. Students and faculty are invited to bring pictures of their loved ones and any offerings they want to bring to the school's ofrenda. This holiday is not a celebration of death, but a celebration of life. It allows us to express our cultures in a way that typically um, feels very sacred only at home. So it allows us also to kind of create like an intersection of community with one another too. So it's actually really, really amazing for us. This holiday creates a space to start educational conversations as well as grief together. This year I have my mom up. My mom recently passed away and it's really nice that HCC and the community that I have here get to know my mother like I knew her and I get to share that with Phil's. I get to share the love that I had and the stories that I have with everyone. The ofrenda or altar will be up for the rest of the week so students are welcome to come on by and leave pictures and reflect together. Working for you, Elisa Torres, 22 News.